pretty simple to read. Most of the stuff is going to be pretty simple for you guys to read. So, you know. But if you guys do have any questions, leave them in the comments below, and I'll help you guys out a lot. Excuse me. And then you're going to see another type of insider trading over here. Uh, this is the top insider trading. So this is the top buying and top selling. So somebody just spent a whole bunch of money buying uh, infrastructure and energy alternatives, which leads me to believe like they just spent $56 million. This might actually be a great play, like a very fantastic play if somebody just spent $56 million on it. So definitely going to keep my eye on that. Meanwhile, somebody just sold a whole bunch of uh, medical care facilities, so option care health uh, stock, $319 million worth. So, you know. That leads me to believe that might go down eventually. Now, that's the main page. If you guys want any more clarity, they do have a first-time guided tour that you guys can take. Pretty simple. It just won't go in, go in as in-depth as I am going for you guys right now. After that, we have news. There is a lot of news, whether you want blogs or you know just traditional news sites. You're going to find it all right here. There's no real easy way to you know filter this data out. Um, the only way you can normally do it is by stock, which is means you have to actually type in the ticker and then you can find uh, news specifically on that stock. But I normally don't even touch this type of stuff. You can view by time or by source, um, you know, Wall Street Journal, Bloomberg. I like Bloomberg personally. Bloomberg has a lot of good news. CNBC is okay, but CNBC seems to have uh, – CNBC likes to go for clicks rather than like good information. Uh, so you got to be careful about that. Anyway, moving off of news, we're going to go to the screener. Now, this is where you guys are going to uh, struggle the most. This is where a lot of the information is going to come in. And this is where you guys have to be patient and just take your time to practice. And you'll understand it eventually. Now, there's three ways uh, or four ways you can actually look at this page. Right now, I have the descriptive uh, tab open. There's also a fundamental tab, a technical tab, and an all tab. I'm just going to use all for now. 